Thanks for taking all that time machine stuff off me, Ramon. No problem, man. Where do you want me to store it? It can't fall into the wrong hands, that's for sure. Put it in the secret compartment above Flo's VA Cafe. No one knows it's there. Great idea, Doc. I know how we can do it, too. Thank you. Thank you very much. That's great information. It appears our old friend Lightning McQueen has access to a time machine. We must have that machine. We must have that system. We have to go back in time. How are we going to get the time machine? It's hidden on top of the VA Cafe. I saw it myself. That's it. We have to steal it. That night, the whole town is sleeping. The lemons make their way towards the VA Cafe. No one knows they're coming. Inside is the time machine. And while some of the lemons stood guard, so Miles Axelrod, Professor Z, and Acer opened the lid and found the time machine and stole it. This is going to be incredible. They loaded it all on top of Sir Miles Axelrod and headed back to the secret lair. But they forgot to close the lid on the V8 Cafe. Early the next morning, Sarge and Fillmore were making their way in to Flo's for a cup of oil. Hello, Sheriff. Hello, Sarge. You going for oil? Yes, we are, said Sarge. Come on and join us. So they all headed towards the V8 Cafe. They stopped by and took Lightning and Sally with them. Can't wait for the first cup of oil, but wait. Why is the roof open on the V8 Cafe? Flo, what's going on? Were you up there last night? What? What, me? I slept like a log. Why, what's wrong? The roof was open on the V8 Cafe. Quick, check the time machine. Hey man, the time machine is gone. I left it here last night. It's completely gone. We're in big trouble. What are we gonna do? All I know is the last car I waited on yesterday was one of those black Russian cars. I wonder if he was a spy. That's it, said Sheriff. They heard everything. Now they have the time machine. We must figure this out. How's it going, Sir Miles Axelrod? I've got it all mounted, but I just can't get it working right. There, I think it's set to go. Where should I go? You have to stop McQueen from landing in Radiator Springs in the first place. He spoiled all our plans. That shouldn't be heard. All I have to do is make sure he doesn't fall out of Mac. I have to go up to 88 miles an hour, and then I'll end up right behind Mac before Lightning falls out. Here goes. Have a good trip, Lightning. I'll wake you when we get to California. Okay, Mac, lock her up. I'm ready to go. And just when Mac was ready to pull out, go to California. Miles Axelrod approaches and puts a locking bar on the back so the door cannot open. So when Mac gets spooked by the liquid road hazards and falls asleep, the door doesn't open up and lightning never lands in Radiator Springs. Stay tuned for chapter two.